We're gonna try and reverse entry this. Are you guys ready for a reverse entry here on Project Cars? Me neither. Oh, I can't even pull it back! What's going on everybody, it's your boy Slab Train. Welcome back today guys, Project Cars again here on the channel. And I gotta say, I've had a lot of requests to play this game with a controller. I know, this is gonna be my first time playing this game on a controller. I can already see half of you guys just saying, Slap, you're in for some bullshit right now, man. You know what I'm saying? It's gonna be absolutely crazy. I'm ready for it though, man. We're gonna give it a shot. We're gonna give it 110 right now today on the controller. I haven't played on a controller in a long time, and I'm not gonna lie to you. Um, and I haven't played Project Cars on a controller at all. So we're gonna go ahead and see how this goes. I'm thinking about running a M3 GT4, maybe. I think that's a solid car all around. 416 horse, just enough to you know get us from point A to point B. And that should be okay. Where to go, man? What the hell? All right, where to go? Right there. Let's go ahead and pick this up for today, and we're going to go, I think we're going to go on California Highway today. Um, just something that I like. Actually, you know what? Let's just switch it up, man. Let's switch it up. Let's go maybe the Nordschleife. We haven't ran the Nordschleife in a long time. Track that I know personally, and something that I can relate to with the controller, um, and, you know, try to get that best lap time. I don't know why I'm even thinking about lap times here on Project Cars, because let's be honest, do you really think I'm going to get through one lap without crashing? I didn't think so either, man. It's going to be absolutely horrendous, but I'm ready to do it, man. I'm ready to do it for science, or I guess, well, it's not really science. I mean, I'm ready to do it for the YouTubes, if you will, and I'm not going to lie to you. Um, I've had a lot of complaints from a lot of people saying, slap, this game is no good with the controller. You know, people just actually sold the game because they were not happy with it. So... We're going to try this out ourselves for today. Um, I'm going to see exactly how the force feedback feels. People were saying that um, the master scale is actually different on the controller. So we're going to go ahead and just tweak it right now. I'm going to see what happens. For those of you guys that actually do controller tune, uh, by all means, leave me your thoughts in the comment section down below for today. Well, here we go, man. All right. So let's get the buttons down, first of all. Looks like we have... Oh! Okay. Well, that's great to start us off right there. That's just absolutely perfect. Thank you. Car is already done in. It's pink. Angry Ant. I mean... Sure. I don't really know why it's Angry Ant, but... Alright. Let's give us another shot here, man. Alright, we're gonna stick in cockpit view for today. We're gonna really lightly work this throttle. I don't think I even have a clutch, do I? Oh my god, you have to be super sensitive on both the throttle and the steering on this game. I have my control freaks plugged in right now. They're not plugged in, they're on top of my... Oh my god! Already getting issues with the controller. We're going to try and tune this as best that we can to ensure that our controller tune is gonna be a little bit better for us game just feels weird though man it's really weird on the controller uh, let's go back to the pit box we're gonna go ahead and edit our tuning setup and we're gonna go and definitely bring down tire pressure uh, that is going to be huge in trying to keep this car stable and on the damn ground uh, we're gonna go ahead and move this force feedback down and I want to see what happens to it when we do we're gonna try that out we're gonna bring that down and we're going to go ahead and try to do a tune for this. I don't really know what to do on this. We're going to go cornering on here. Um, and we're going to also... Do I, you know what? We're going to increase the steering ratio on here. I really don't know how that's going to affect the car. But we're going to give it a shot. Uh, camber on this car, we're going to go ahead and bring it down. Just because, you know, we're going to try and keep the rubber on the road. That's my biggest concern at this point. I don't want to have the car kind of slide out. So we're going to try and do that. Uh, ride height, we're going to lower it. Keep the center of gravity to a minimum. Okay, just going to bring that right down then. We're not going to worry about the spring rates too much. Bump stops, we're not going to worry about. Limited slip, we are going to bring up though. Um, and that should be okay. Final drive, we should be good. Preload for the engine. Oh man, okay. Oh, fuel load, sorry, fuel load. Read that wrong. 
And let's give this a shot, man. Let's see if uh, this is going to change anything. I doubt it, but let's try it, though. There we go. Feels a little bit better. The steering! Oh my god, man. This is brutal. Just kind of slid that rear end right around that corner. I don't know if you guys seen that. Oh my god. No! Oh! At least we didn't hit the wall, though. That I will take. Man, this is frustrating on here, man. I'm not gonna lie to you. See, the biggest thing is, you know, moving your left and right finger, you know, ever so slowly. And when I'm playing these games, you know, my finger doesn't move slowly, man. It wants to go rapid fire. And if I gotta just, you know, cut down on the power a little bit on these corners, I will just to make it around here. We're driving like grandma on the Nuremberg ring, but that's okay, though. Oh, man. Getting a little bit of speed. We're going up to 110. 120. Over the jump. Bring it down to fourth gear. Ooh, we pedaled it just a little bit. We got it, though. Oh, no! The whip on there is ridiculous, man. We got it. I do not recommend playing this game with a controller with the stock tune. I know there are tunes out there for the controller. Um, now, if you guys do have any of those, by all means, man, throw them up in the comment section down below. Oh! Come on! This is definitely by far the hardest game to play with the controller on that I have played at least. Uh, four to five is pretty tough when you're on simulation, and this is kind of the same thing, if you will, right? I mean, it's the same style. Here we go. We're looking good, though. I mean, it could have been worse. It's not unplayable by any means, but it definitely is a lot harder than uh, what you would expect. Okay. No, it was actually full lock to the left and the driver went to the right. I'm not really too sure about that. You can see the car already pulling to the left. Oh my goodness. One more good hit and we're done. I can't even keep this thing straight. Oh! Alright. Look at that, man. We're about to flip the damn thing. We're going to quit out of here. We're going to head over to the California Highway. And we're going to bring out something a little bit more powerful right now, man. Maybe a Zonda. Maybe the Lycan. Who knows? But I'm down to rip something fast. I'll tell you that, man. I want to see this thing on the controller. Now, you know what? Instead of ripping something fast, let's take this to an all-time favorite right now, man. Silverstone National. And let's see if we can drift this thing. I'm... I don't know, man. I don't think we're going to be able to. Um... It's a very tough game to slide on the controller. It really is. And I mean, I actually wanted to do a couple videos last week drifting online with a couple buddies. And they didn't have the wheel. And they're like, you know what? Ah, uh, no. Because it's just, it, it's, it's really impossible is what they said. You know, you just can't do it. Mind you, I've seen it done. So I don't know if they're lying. You know, they're not good enough drivers out there. I'm just messing with you guys. But all I'm saying, though, is that it's very hard to drift on this game. We're going to go ahead and tune this sucker up right away. Gonna bust out this rear tire pressure right up like we're playing Forza Motorsport here. Uh, master scale force feedback. That should be okay. Steering ratio, we're gonna bring it up a little bit faster. And here we go. We need some camber on this car, big time. Limited slip, we're gonna bring it right down. We're gonna pop up this preload. And where did our camber? Oh, here we go. Alright, so front right, we don't need to worry about. Rear left is what we need to be looking at here. We're going to go with a negative 2.5 on there, all around, and let's give this a shot right now. I have no idea how this is going to go. Here we go. You know what, let's even go into third person for Forza's sake, man. Here we go. This game looks absolutely gorgeous, though. I missed my right stick, man. I can look around finally. I feel like I'm free now, man. I'm not confined to just the left and right. I can go up, down. I can do whatever I want right now. Oh, shit. We're already sliding. 
Okay. Okay, let's go. I'm gonna rip it then. No. Okay. We're gonna try and reverse entry this. Are you guys ready for a reverse entry here on Project Cars? Me neither. Oh, I can't even pull it back. I couldn't even pull the damn thing back. Okay. It's not like I wanted to, you know, not turn out of that there. Appreciate that. Let's go with a little bit less camber. Just gonna bring it all down to point one. Front camber, we're gonna bring it right back down. I want all rubber on the road for today. Everything. 1.1 for the rear and 0.0 .0 on the front. If we can't pull it back right now, then I am at a loss for words. I don't know. Here we go, baby. Keep hitting the damn X button like it's my shift button. What is e-brake? I'm trying to figure out what e-brake is. Is that B? I am tripping. Why is this guy waving at me, man? Stop waving at me. Keep missing the damn view, too. Here we go. What is that? What is going on? I'm not even going that way. Oh my god, that steering lock glitch is at it again. Reverse entry, attempt two, right here. Let's go. Oh, come on. Oh, okay. Yeah, it is almost impossible to drift on here. This is absolutely bananas. This game's not meant for drifting, of course. But it would have been nice if it was able to. I mean, that's what I wanted right there. Appreciate that. Woo! I'm getting tripped out right now. At least we can slide on the grass, man. The grass feels... Okay, I'm pointing to the right, and it's going to the left. That doesn't make any sense. Now, I figured to finish this off today, we would go and grab the Ariel Atom V8. Now, this is an absolute monster. 430 horsepower. Mid-engine V8 is just going to tear your face off. Now, we're going to take this down the California Highway, and we're going to see how well I can control this thing. I mean, obviously, after that display, I'm not expecting much. But, if I can make it through the course, I will be happy, man. I mean, that's... All right. Are we ready? I don't know, man. I, I, I don't even know if I'm ready. Okay. Here we go. Oh, look at that pull to the right. Oh, my God. This thing looks like a damn rocket ship from right here. Oh my god, hold it! Oh, of course. Can never seem to hold it when we're trying to counter steer the other way. It just does not work. But whenever I'm on the wheel, though, it works. Explain that to me. I have no idea, man. Bring that right down to first gear here. See that suspension just taking one hell of a damn push here. And I will say, though, this game would be a lot easier if our range of motion oh on our actual throttles on our left and right triggers were bigger you know if they were amped up a little bit more um this game would be a lot easier to play with because it's all about throttle control and just making sure that you're not kind of making the car go unstable like right there come on man i don't know why my hands are moving so damn slow on this thing that's it that's it hold on hold on can I just go to return to pit box? Really? I gotta restart the whole damn thing? Oh, okay, there we go. Okay, okay. So, let's try this out here. I'm gonna go ahead and... Like, why is this all the way set to slow? We're gonna move it right up to fast, man. I don't understand why that's there like that. But... Oh, okay. It's frozen again. Here we go. That is a lot better. Kind of, no... I mean, it doesn't really get any better than that because that is the fastest steering sensitivity that we can get. Ooh, okay, we got it coming down there right now. So it looks like the key, though, is making sure that your steering is all the way up. 
Oh, wave reduction. Stage three. What the hell just fell off there, man? Oh, damn. It's just a cover. That is pretty damn dope. I'm not going to lie to you. Oh, I meant to hit the e-brake. That's what I meant to do. Wrong button. My bad. Come on now. God damn it. There was another piece. Just go into first. No. Oh! Alright, that's it, man. I'm gonna just obliterate this. I'm just gonna ram this into the wall, doing 200, hopefully. There we go. Forget this game. Forget this Adam. Forget this damn controller life. I don't like it. Oh! Ladies and gentlemen, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Hopefully, I put a smile on your face. Because, uh, yeah. I cannot drive on the controller. Look at all the pieces flying off, man. This is crazy right now. Gotta say, Project Cards did a fantastic job with the damage models. You know, just making sure that everything is, you know, something that can come off at least. It's just crazy, man. You can strip this thing right down to the bare roll cage. And I just want to get back on the road. That'd be great. I know suspension's messed up. But we'll live. As long as we don't go off this damn cliff. Yep. Let's just wall ride the whole thing right now, man. This is simulation at its finest right here, man. Oh, my God. Ladies and gentlemen... Thank you guys very much for coming around today. Project Cars with the controller. Absolute fail. I can't even get my car in to first gear right now. That'd be great. Thank you. God damn. Can I just make a full damn turn? That'd be great. Oh my god. Do not tell me to do this again. Please, guys. Because this is painful right now. Probably to watch. And this is all. Ladies and gentlemen, if you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. Become a member of Team Slap today to start spinning some damn rubber with us. As well, too, you guys can follow me on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter, all of which are found in the description box down below. Look at this damn thing, man. I'm so sorry for doing this to you, man. Oh, my God. We're going to take this thing back to the shop and get it worked on. Ladies and gentlemen, Chibota Slap Train, I'm out. Peace. What a slide train and welcome back guys. Um.